I mean, I, I think that uh, I just came in. I just came in ready. I had the right mindset. You know, Nate talked. Nate talked to me before the game. Uh, told me that I was starting. You know, I was gonna play big minutes and just be be confident and be ready. You know, I thought my teammates did a good job finding me early, uh, knocked down some open shots. You just always got to be ready. You know, uh, going back to last year. You know, uh, just watching and talking to Solomon Hill. You know, he was he was a, a big uh, help towards me. You know, when I was out, um, he always taught me to be ready. And, uh, your opportunity is gonna be. Your name's gonna be called. You know, opportunity. <laughs> be given. Um, that's just what I try to do. How much of a challenge is it to be patient waiting for that time? I mean, it's, it's a big challenge. You know, like I said, this is year three for me, and it's really um, the first time that I've been getting, you know, reasonable good minutes, you know, in this league. Uh, so, you know, I think that uh, just just trusting and just believing, um, being confident in myself, you know, continue to work on my game, uh, that's been huge for me, and I just want to stay that way. And they talked to me before the game, you know, he was like, um, just told me the situation with Paul, and uh, just be confident in myself, you know, let the game come to me, you know, that's what I thought I did tonight, um, you know, and, and he did a good job communicating me and showing some confidence. <laughs> and um, just trusting me, you know, and, and telling me that I'm going to be getting big minutes. So just be ready to be ready to play, uh, treat my body right. Did you take a different defensive approach? Nate said he talked to you also, but you got to yeah. step it up on defense. Yeah, I did. You know, I thought that uh, first couple possessions, um, you know, I really got into my man. You know, um, I think he got a black shot, you know, first first possession and first second possession. Um, defensively, I just tried to step up, you know, and I seen the whole team amp up from that. Um, I thought that we played really well. Uh, we, we pressured the ball. We got into him, created some turnovers, you know, and we, the difference is we had fun. We had fun playing tonight, and uh, we want to play like that every night. Mm -hmm. Has that been a missing piece? Definitely, definitely. You know, I, I've been saying it, you know, just from watching it. Um, like I said, that's why I try to bring a little energy. You know, I'm not always going to be the rah-rah guy, but I'm, I'm a guy that can lead by example, a guy that can come in, um, speed things up, pressure the ball, um, come in and make big plays and uh, kind of be that, that guy, that missing piece that we need. I mean, long season, guys are injured, you know, uh, you have stuff like that. But I mean, the biggest thing now is, you know, uh, we know most of our sets, you know, we know what we need to do. Now it's about, all right, we see that on film, we clean it up that way. Because uh, we don't have a whole bunch of practice time anymore, you know, we shouldn't be practicing for two hours anymore. Um, you know, we got we got some smart guys, some, some smart vets on, on this team. And I think that, uh, you know, like yesterday's practice was great. You know, it wasn't long. We came in here, watched film, ran through some sets, you know, cleaned up some things we needed to clean up, and we got out of here. And I think that um, that's the type of things that we're going to have to do moving forward, especially with injuries.